backdrop for today's Word in Your Lug is one of Northern Ireland's most famous landmarks. It's beautiful Belfast Castle in Cave Hill Country Park in North Belfast. Now, of course, castles often have connotations of brave soldiers standing on the ramparts defending their territory. But this particular castle was built in 1862 as a stately home. However, I still think it is a very good backdrop for today's Word, brave. What does brave mean in Ulster Scots? Well, it shares the standard English meaning of courageous, but uh, I think the linguistic term is it's a modifier. So people would say you're a brave good TV presenter, <laughs> or people that don't know you as well might say you're a brave decent body. <laughs> There is a particular story about Brave told about a man called Robert Quigg. Robert Quigg was awarded the Victoria Cross for his bravery on the first day of the Battle of the Somme. And he was presented with a medal at Sandringham Cottage on the Sandringham Estate. And the King allegedly presented him with the medal and said, you're a brave man, Quigg. And according to his nephew, Leonard, Robert Quigg turned around and said, you're a brave king yourself. Really? Really? That, that, that's a brave good story, Liam, and you obviously have it on good authority. Swears it's nearly true. <laughs> love it, love it. Just before we finish, Liam, can I just check another meaning of the word brave? If you've had perhaps too much to drink on a Saturday night, could it be said that you've had a brave bit? Yes. I couldn't possibly comment whether you had a brave bit on Saturday night, <laughs> but if you had quite a lot to drink, people might say, Jane had a brave bit to drink. I have to say you've given me a brave, good explanation of the word brave, so thank you very much. And clearly, brave is a very useful word in Ulster Scots. We'll see you next time. I think you understood it bravely, Jane. <laughs>